Common indicators for supplier assessment, taking into account the different production scales of different enterprises, the supply of different raw materials, there is no uniform standard for the requirements of supplier assessment, but in general, can be assessed from the price, quality, delivery, service, credit, cooperation in six areas, and in the form of a percentage system to calculate the score, as to how to allocate, depending on the specific circumstances of the company to decide. Assessment of the supplier's price level can be compared with the average price of the same class of products in the market and the lowest price, respectively, with the average price of the market ratio and the lowest price of the market ratio to indicate. Quality is the most important factor in the assessment of suppliers in the beginning of a period of time, mainly to strengthen the inspection of product quality. The quality can be assessed by quality pass rate, average pass rate, batch return rate and incoming material exemption rate. Specifically, it can be assessed and calculated according to the following. Overall, the higher the quality pass rate, the better the quality of its products, the higher the score. The higher the pass rate, the better the quality and the higher the score. A higher batch return rate indicates poorer quality and a lower score. Delivery time is also a very important assessment index. Examination of the delivery period is mainly to examine the supplier's on-time delivery rate, delivery cycle, and so on. On-time delivery rate can be measured by the ratio of the number of on-time deliveries to the total number of deliveries. Delivery cycle, that is, from the date the order is issued to the time of receipt of the length of time, often in days D as a unit. At the same time, it should be noted that some companies will also be the level of the supplier's logistics system. The supplier's logistics system, the supplier's own company whether the implementation of the just-in-time supply, and so on into the supplier assessment indicators. The level of service is also included in the assessment of suppliers. Like other assessment indicators, the assessment of the supplier's performance in terms of support, cooperation, and service is usually a qualitative assessment. And the relevant indicators are means of communication, feedback, attitude of cooperation, participation in the company's improvement and development projects, and after-sales service. Creditworthiness mainly assesses the extent to which the supplier fulfills its own commitments, treats people in good faith, and does not intentionally delay or default on payment. Specifically, it can be calculated by the following formula. In the process of getting along with suppliers, the degree of cooperation is also very important, often because of changes in the environment or changes in the specific situation. It is necessary to adjust and change the work tasks. Such changes may lead to changes in the supplier's way of working, or even to a slight sacrifice on the part of the supplier. It is therefore possible to examine the extent to which the supplier cooperates positively in these respects. In addition, if there are difficulties or problems with the work, sometimes the supplier's cooperation is required to solve them. These are the times when the degree of cooperation of the supplier can be seen. In the field of electronics manufacturing, the component market is complex and dynamic, fluctuations in supply and demand, delivery time, obsolescence, counterfeit components, and many other factors, procurement should be more comprehensive assessment of the supplier. To reduce procurement risk, the above supplier assessment methods hope to help you solve the procurement problem. Whether we stock brands Micron, TI, or other electronic component brands, we can provide you with price as close as authorized distributors, 100% original electronic components, authoritative test reports, excellent after-sales service. Welcome to click our website for more information.